Hey, everyone. Wolford. Uh, well, as you can probably see, I'm in my new dorm. And it's very echoey, 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 echoey. <laughs> I'm in my uh, new apartment now. Uh, as you can probably already tell, a lot bigger than the other one. <clears throat> which, uh, I'm already liking that a lot. I mean, by me, I mean half the room. <laughs> um, but yeah, I moved into a, uh, didn't really, or I've been running around Waco probably all day. Haven't played any Old Republic Day. Need to do that. <laughs> After this vlog, I'm probably gonna get on Old Republic and, uh, play some of my level 12 Sith Juggernaut. Which, oh, Wolford is so addicted to, uh, Old Republic now. So addicted to it. Oh, but it's so good. <laughs> oh, but so good. But, uh, pretty much all that's been going on today. Uh, <laughs> uh, I just got done watching a little bit of uh, Girls Bravo, which is a kind of adult anime. <laughs> but uh, I really like it, not just for the adult part of it. I like it because I mean, it's funny and everything. And uh, this is a great little kind of love story kind of thing. Uh, roommate didn't hear you, had to go to work, but... Uh, <clears throat> I just sitting all day. I got to play a little bit more with uh, with my Connect. I actually got to play Rise of Nightmares and get past the running part. Which, when I was at my parents' house, I couldn't get past the running part because the Connect couldn't see my whole body. It would only see my head and less than what you're seeing on the webcam right now. It would it would see maybe you know, no, a little bit more. It'd be like head to a little bit of my stomach and then a little bit down to my hips, and that'd be it. But in the new room, I got more than the six feet, you know, that's needed. And I can, you know, so I got past that room part, no problem. I just stood over there like an idiot and just, uh, and made it. So I got to play more Rise of Nightmares today. I got two achievements on that. I bought, uh, I bought, uh, what is it, Midnight Club? Yeah, Midnight Club LA, the complete edition from Walmart when I went shopping today for, Twenty dollars, so plus well, had all the DLC with it, so I was like, eh, you know, twenty dollars, it's kind of bargain. I've heard it's a good game, you know, I'll get it. It's okay. It's not not the best racing game I've ever played, but uh, it's it's pretty good. Um, tomorrow, basically, I'm gonna do it, but do it today. Um, <clears throat> Monday I start classes, but you know, first week classes are are nothing at all, so. You know, I'll, I'll have nothing to do. Um, I'm kind of thirsty, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna take uh, I'm gonna take you guys on a little not really tour of my apartment. We're just gonna move around here while I get a sobe out of the fridge because Wolford's thirsty. All Wolford's had to drink today was uh, two Coca Colas, so Wolford's getting a little thirsty. We're in the kitchen now. And we're moving back into my room. <laughs> Being sure not to trip over my 360 controller, which is just sitting there. As I said, I was watching uh, anime over here. And as you can and probably can't tell, my com my uh, TV rather is all the way over there with my 360 and a uh, Kinect, which you can't see at the moment. But they're back there, believe me. I believe this is the first time I've ever drinking anything in a vlog. Sorry, but like I said, I get a little thirsty uh, talking in these things. I'm, uh, <clears throat> at the moment, sorry about that. moment I'm fighting off a uh, minor sinus infection with a uh, stuffed up nose and a stuffed up ear, which I've been fighting off all day, but <laughs> said, shake these sobeys up. Shake it well. Shake the lizard. I'm shaking the lizard. Everyone punching it. <laughs> Um, love Sobe. Oh, I'll only take little drinks. <laughs> That'll probably have plenty of sound to you guys, but, uh, uh, <coughs> sorry. Uh, so just, you know, hanging out here today, or wasn't well, awake up most of the day. What a time war, so I'd go get a modem for my, uh, internet from this room, or for at least to get a separate modem. And they were sold out, or that not sold out, but they couldn't get them out anymore because they're out of them. They're like, 
Are you with uh, GSD Zone? Yeah. And they go, well, if you're here for a modem for, Red River, or for your apartment, sorry, we can't give it to you. Where I'm, I was like, are you kidding? Like, no, come back Monday and we'll, and we'll, uh, we'll, we might have something that like, might, well, we are going to go up there, uh, Monday and hopefully I can get a modem then and I can be on my own. Uh, when I post this and when I play, uh, Old Republic and stuff later, I'll be on, uh, his router, which are his modem, but my router, which is kind of what you can do because, uh, campus housing said that's what you can do. But if I want faster internet, I need my own modem. So, you know, what I'm not doing is illegal. It's, it's totally illegal. I just prefer a faster internet, especially when I'm playing Old Republic or something like that. Because, I mean, Old Republic doesn't run really good on my PC. On my laptop or other. It runs decently. It runs, you know. But I, I just, you know. It doesn't run optimally. It's it's it barely skims by the minimum. I think requirements. I don't know if my uh, desktop will run it. I'm probably gonna see that. I'm probably gonna dig the disk out from over there and uh, <clears throat> see if it'll run my desktop. And if it'll run my desktop, I might start playing on my desktop and uh, just keep it on my laptop if I'm over at a friend's house or something, and we like won't play over there. But, uh, <coughs> I really, I really don't know if it's going to run the desktop. If it doesn't, oh well, I'll still have the laptop and uh, it'll run minimally. And so, I'll just have to deal with minimum, you know, like when I'm outside of Corbon and stuff, the, the game runs fine. But right now I'm at Drumkos, the, uh, the Imperial Homeworld, the Sith Imperial Homeworld, I should say. Uh, anywhere I'm at, I run slow as heck. Like, literally, my guy will, like, I, I'll show you. He'll just be like. Only a little bit faster than that, but still. He'll run. <laughs> he will run about that. He'll run a bit faster than what I was doing. I was over exaggerating. But, uh. Still, you know. He runs kind of slow like that. But, uh. It's still it's still a fun game. I still love it. I mean, if if I had to give a score at uh, one out of ten right now, I'd rate it over nine thousand because it's just that good. It's just that great of a game. If you haven't played it already, uh, you can buy it from GameStop for. Uh, I think it's about sixty three dollars or so. Because when I bought it, I had a two dollars of store credit with me, so uh, probably that sixty-five dollars you can go to GameStop or so and get a uh, get the non-collector's edition of it, and uh, <clears throat> or you my you can buy me and buy the collector's edition still. I don't know, but because uh, they offer me both, I just said regular. But uh, you know, buy one of the editions. Uh, it's three disc from uh, GameStop. You'll just put your CD drive, of course, and uh, it's like when you set up Windows or something. You're going to have to babysit it, kind of. You can't just, like, because when I installed it, we were uh, we were editing the Wolf of Brim, or we were trying to get the computer available to edit uh, the, the Christmas episode and the New Year's episode in our uh, driving vlog where I drove to GameStop to, I said, go buy Assassin's Creed Revelations, but that's when I bought a... Uh, <clears throat> That's when I bought a uh, Old Republic, but uh, I mean, I went to screensaver because I didn't move the mouse, but uh, and po Old Republic screensaver popped up, but uh, but yeah, so uh, and uh, you go home, you like I said, you put three, di you put three discs, you kind of babysit it, you uh, after it installs, you go to uh, oh, uh S -T -S -W -T -O -R dot com. You set up your account, you set up your security questions, you set up your uh, subscription. Um, it's I think that's all you set up is your subscription and everything like that. You can apply for a security key through Origin, which is EA's uh, kind of, I guess, rival to Steam, I guess you could say. But after you set everything up, you can uh, download the client, uh, 
as soon as the client downloads, it will ask you for your username, password, and if you have a security key, input all that information, and then it will, uh, uh, it might ask you a security question, you enter that in, and then you enter your answer to the question ask in, and then you, uh, you, you start playing. Me, on the other hand, this, this idiot right here, entered his wrong security question and or answer to the security question and entered his password wrong. He has a, got his account locked and I had to call customer support to finally play the darn game. That ticked Wolford off just a bit. But, uh, customer service is really helpful, actually, too. And a nice lady, you know, helped me through it. Um, uh, pretty much about it. Uh, <laughs> uh, Gotta leave it something again. Um, I don't know. Oh, you know, it, it's the new year. I, I'll, I'll treat you to some uh, more Katy Perry. Which I heard she actually is getting divorced from her husband. Yeah, everyone, that was Fireworks, uh, K. Perry. Uh, <clears throat> be sure to watch the two new videos, our new, our finale for Season 2, and our uh, our premiere episode for Season 3 uh, of Wolford and Dick. Uh, everyone, until next time, Wolford out.